All right, so we got some mail from Capital Currency, and I don't know if y'all know it or not. Um, I actually posted on two of my channels on the community tab that Capital Currency was back. He had uh, put out a couple videos, throwing some stuff up for sale. Um, said reach out to him if it was something you wanted, uh, that kind of thing. And um, yeah, so people seem to forget people's community tabs and don't see a lot of it but uh, I try to put out quite a bit of information there from time to time um, channels that have come back channels that are restarting uh, videos that people have done different things like that things that I think are cool so y'all stick around and uh, let's see what we got So this thing is uh, it's pretty snug, so I'm gonna have to kind of be careful here. Make sure I don't I don't know what all is in here. Like I know what I bought, but I mean there might be a shirt or a sticker or who knows what may be in here. So you have to kind of be careful. When you're opening people's packages, because you don't want to mess up something. that uh, you'd like to keep. There we go. Oh, look at that. I see some cloth in there. And that is why you have to be careful. Alright, so I'll do my normal well, even though his logo is on here, I will still keep that for shipping because, well, what's wrong with that? If I ship it and it's got his logo on there, that's just getting him some, uh, some screen time there. Whoever I make something for and ship it to may not know. So we'll cut this down to where it's usable and... I can wrap a, somebody's coin in it or who knows so yeah there's that the other part is trash and let's see what we got we got us an extra large Ooh, we got stuff everywhere um shirt that is freaking awesome there's his logo. I don't have to take it all the way out. Y'all can see. I appreciate that, dude. I really do. All right. Let's see what we got. So, I'm pretty sure I bought some stuff from him, but it was not this much stuff. Let's Let's start with the... Let's start with the paper here. All right, let's make sure there's nothing else in there. All right. So he wrote me a little hand receipt for what I what I got. Shirt, buttons, keychain, sticker, magnet pack. He's got all kinds of loot, y'all. Ten dollar gift certificate for any poor. That's freaking awesome, dude. I appreciate that because you know I'm gonna get some of your stuff I like to collect something from everybody in the community silver scorpion thank you for your continued support of my channel your friendship means a lot to me I threw in a little extra for being my first buyer I hope you enjoy it <laughs> it will be forever appreciated much love respect my friend sincerely capital currency Come 
I ain't seen a 3x5 card this big in a while. Awesome. I guess it's not really 3x5, but you know. So I got his stickers. That looks like a sticker you can put on the window and it shows through. That's kind of neat. That's kind of neat. Got a magnet that goes. I've got a gun safe that I put everybody's magnets on. Thank you. I appreciate that. You know, when I was a kid, I used to make presents that would take people forever to get into. And as I've gotten older, I don't appreciate it quite as much as I used to. Because now I'm the one that takes forever to get into something. Alright, 1962 quarter. Stand in Liberty. And a 50 cent piece. So I know I've mentioned this a bunch of times, but I'm hoping, hoping now, because it's a, I got a long, long way to go. Um, but I'd like to have one of each type of, of currency. And I, I, I say type. I consider these different. This is the Standing Liberty quarter, and this is the, what I call a regular quarter. But I'd like to have a tube of each type of uh, currency for my kids to uh, pass down to them um because it'll, it'll be worth some money i mean y'all know these are what like 15 bucks a piece nowadays 20 something like that um which is only a 40 percent so maybe a little less but <clears throat> still i want to give them a tube of a fort of 40s tube of the 90s and then the two or three other types of halves there are out there all 90s I'll try to get them a tube each of those if I make it to all the US currency and have a tube of each one of them full then I'm probably gonna start on Canadian and try to fill those for them as well. But as you can see, if something comes from him, it's gonna be wrapped good. It's a keychain. I'm gonna assume this is the button, yeah. So I do tend to collect one of each from people and anything beyond that one that I have, I tend to add to giveaways, not as a giveaway itself, but I tend to uh, throw it in with something that somebody won just to help you know, spread around other channels and stuff. Looks like I got somebody standing beside me waiting to steal something already. Alright, so this is really what caught my attention uh, when he posted the stuff. Uh, United States Mint Respect, Honor, and Remember 2021 National Law Enforcement Memorial Museum Commemorative Coin Program Proof Clad Half Dollar. So I saw these when they came out and I thought they were pretty neat. Um, not 100% up my alley, but somewhat up my alley. It's not silver, it's just a commemorative thing. Um, I had a grandpa who was a trooper and, and police officer and dad and stuff like that. So this stuff is kind of important to me. Um, so it comes in the box. Certificate of Authenticity. So yeah, so it's not silver, it is clad, but it is still pretty cool. Uh, the price at the time, I was like, eh, it's kind of steep for me to buy a coin that's not silver for that price um but sometimes you kind of change your mind over time and then you're you're willing so 
but I, I had some family in law enforcement and stuff so stuff like this is kind of kind of nice to collect um, what really gets me and this is actually something that I, somebody actually asked me if I could do this and they have not got back to me yet so I, I'm assuming they're still working on it it's been a few months since I heard from them but there's a fingerprint on this coin and somebody wanted me to laser engrave somebody's fingerprint onto a coin which I think I can do probably without any um, I think the laser will handle it pretty easy but it's a matter of getting the the picture um, of the correct quality and being able to do it so I'm, I'm kinda looking forward to that um, and being able to do that for them if they uh, still want that to happen I hadn't heard back from them in a while and for any of y'all that may be new um, that's kind of what I do I like to to create stuff for people that they can't get created anywhere else um, that's kind of important to me um, because memories is um, basically what life is about what memories you create what mem memories you have later and uh, what memories you leave with your children and stuff so got all my stuff in all my loot thank you sir i greatly appreciate it i will tag him in the top uh so if you don't know who capital currency is um you do now and you can pick them up pretty easy and uh, we'll see y'all next time